hello welcome to my youtube channel myself amrit you might think why i am wearing this cap the answer is simple because in this video i am teach you how to create a cap mock up in just a simple steps i am teach you how to create a design and place on this cap and make a beautiful cap mock up so let's get started the video to follow this tutorial you can download a image from a descriptions in the first step just make a copy of a background layer press ctrl plus j to make a copy of it and just change its name to a cap so after that convert it into a smart object right click on it and convert it into a smart object after converting it into a smart object just go to side panel and make a selection of a cap so i will select here a quick selection tool to make a selection of a cap you will select uh, whatever tool you like to make a selection of a cap i will just select here a quick selection tool now i will make a selection of a cap my selection is ready after making a selection go to adjustment layers and create a mask on it so now my mask is added on this cap after creating a mask just press control and click on this mask button and with the selection active go to adjustment layers and select here a hue saturation i will selecting a hue saturation here because now i will change a color of a cap so i will select here a hue saturation if you want to learn how to use this hue saturation to change a color of any t-shirt or a car or anything you may see this video after selecting a hue saturation just click on this colorize and i will turn a uh, this white cap to a black so just decrease the lightness to create a black color so i will okay with it and click on this properties now i will change its name to cap color after changing its color just go to side panel and select here a rectangle tool and just create here a rectangle after creating a rectangle just right click on it and convert it into a smart object we are converting it into a smart object because later on we are a place any design on it without any difficulty so now just change its name to your design here and open this smart object just click on it now we are creating a design in this document so just go to side panel and select here a text tool and just type here i am just type here my text you can change a text color in a top panel just click on this box button and you can change here a text color whatever color you like i am just selecting here a white color and you can also change here a size of text i am just increase its size to 150 pixels and now i am a type here my text freedom after typing a text i am adjust it into a lower side just select a move tool and adjust it where you want this text i am adjust it here now i am creating a vector art of a word to create a vector of a word i am a select here a word image just type on a google word and select here a images you can select here a whatever image you like i am a selecting here a this image just drag this image to photoshop or a photopia i am just drag this image into my software just place here with this our image is open in our software now i am creating a vector art of this image to create a vector art i am selecting a pen tool here just select a pen tool from a left side panel or type a shortcut key p to select a pen with this pen tool i am creating a vector of this word just click on it press alt key to set this to a upper side now i am click here to create a head of word and i am just creating here now its wings 
I am creating a lower part of this word. To see a pass through, just click on this fill layer and select here this none. With this, we see a clear picture of a word. Now, just make a word vector. We are creating a word vector with the help of a pen tool. Now, just delete these images which we drag out earlier. Now, just delete this image and select this shape where we creating our word and just change its name to a word. Now, I am just select a color here. I am selecting a white color here. You can select a whatever color you like. Now, I select a move tool and adjust this word to a center. Press control key to zoom this word. I am okay with it. Now, I am adjust it here. Now, our design is ready here. I am turn this color off and now I am save this design to our smart object. Press control S to save our design and now you see here your design. Open your real image and you now see here. Now our design is place on our cab. To make it more elastic, just change its blend mode from normal to screen. Just select here a screen. You now why we are selecting here a blend mode of a screen not a multiply because our design is a brighter color which is a white if we are selecting here a multiply blend mode this is gone from our image you can see here the only reason here is a selecting of a screen blend mode because our design color is a white so i am selecting here a screen blend mode so to make it more elastic i am changing its blend if just take it all the way from a darker areas and press alt key to break this slider where you see this cap texture is also created on our design i am okay with it and also take it all the way from a brighter areas just drag this slider to a left press alt key to break this slider and take it all the way to right after that hit a ok button where you are satisfied so now i am click on this ok button have a look at it this is looking now more elastic you can change here cap color to whatever color you like just select this cap color layer just click on it and you can play with this hue when you drag this to a right you can see here the color is changing just increase this saturation amount you can select a whatever color you like in your image just you can see here so i am selecting here this color you can also play with this light so i am okay with it you can select a color whatever you like so now select this cap layer and this design layer press shift to select these all three layers and make a group of it press ctrl g to make a group of it and just change its name to cap mockup now go to adjustment layers and select here a color fill layer with this color fill layer we are changing a color of a background just select here whatever color you like i am selecting a color from our cap after that hit a ok button and drag this layer to a under the cap mockup and you can see here our background color is changed now to make a some more realistic look just select this cap and add a drop shadow to make uh, this more realistic i am click on it and selecting here a drop shadow with this drop shadow we are giving a final touch to our mockup to change uh, values of a drop shadow just double click on it and you can change its value here i am selecting here angle of a drop shadow to a 90 degree i am just type here 90 and you can also play with here its size its distance from a cap i am okay with these values you can copy this value or you can selecting your own after that just hit a okay button have a look at it this is looking realistic mockup you can see here this is 
बिफोर दिस इज अवर फाइनल रिजल्ट आफ्टर क्रिएटिंग दिस डिजाइन एंड प्लेसिंग ऑन अवर कैप यू कैन फॉलो दिज स्टेप्स टू क्रिएट दिस रियलास्टिक मॉकअप I hope you really enjoy this video and if you did make sure you like this video and also subscribe this channel for more tutorial like this so see you in the next video till then bye bye